misses. He hit the corner and tries for third. The relay throw, but he is in there with a triple. Even the best center fielders make mistakes once in a while, and that's definitely the case here. He totally misplays it, and by the time he recovers, no chance of now keeping back. him from the ending up field. third. To the plate Steel. now, Steele Walker. Walker. Oh. Throw gets him, two down. Now at the plate, Nick Prado, runner in scoring oh, position with Sugan. The first base. Here's the first pitch Nick. to him. Chopped up Prado. the line to first. But a foul ball here, 0 and 1. Fouled off. Nope. And on 0 and 2, he misses with a fastball. Count. 1 and 2. Boy, that was an awfully close pitch right there. I know if I'm on the mound. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Now to the plate, number 16. Now 0 for 1 for him here in this one. 16. Hey, see it. Rip it. Here you go. First offering on its way. Oh, missed that one by a oh, mile. One, it's 0 and 1. Come on, man. Man, that pitch had the Get look of a fastball. There. Straight changeup, and the bottom fell out of it. And this ball is heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2 now. From the belt, kicks and deals. Hard hit ball to second. Leaps and makes a terrific catch. And with that, the side is retired. A ball ticketed for right center, but the ticket is revoked as he goes up to pull this. And that'll bring up the catcher, Chance Cisco. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 Man. in the ball game. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Finally, a little something for them to get excited about. Yeah, a rally can begin with the single swing of the bat, and this might be their chance right here. They've struggled to produce a lot of runs, but there he is at second base. A shot to the outfield scores him. Then who knows what kind of roll they could get on. Got to take it one good at bat at a time. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. Coming to the plate now, Donovan now Casey. Batting. He flew out in his last at bat. Donovan. Yeah, and I'm sure he'd like a base hit Casey. of some sort right hey. here, Matty. But hey, you know what? Another fly out all wouldn't be all count. that bad. If he can get it deep enough, he should be able to drive in a nice ah. run with a sack fly. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. He got him, and it'll probably take a base hit now to get that runner across from third. That strikeout changes the whole complexion of the inning. He was definitely pitching for it with a runner oh, on third and one out, and he got it. Now it's going to take a hit or something three. like a wild pitch to get that guy home. Hey, we got two. Two down. Tying run at the plate, the 0-1. Nope. There is a base open here, so the option to work around him is there if they want to go that route. Hey, and it's two. one and two. One ball, two strikes to count. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Now batting, Jose Urquidy. He'll start things out in the sixth for a lineup that really hasn't found its Jose groove in this one. Urquidy. Yeah, only two hits so far, Matt, and not Aye. very many hard hit balls either. We'll see if they can start making some adjustments. This year against right-handed pitching, Urquidy is a sub-100 hitter, but that's not all that uncommon for pitchers, of course. He'd be the first to tell you he's not happy with his batting average this season, but he can beat you in a variety of different ways, and he has to because he wouldn't be here otherwise. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Armenteros comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. Stepping in, Brian Rocchio. He went down on strikes last time up. Brian Rocchio. Fought off at the plate as it's chopped foul. The windup and the 0 1. Aye. And he takes strike two. You get him yourself, man. Right this here. guy's go. really pitched well so far, attacking the strike zone, and he's really kept these hitters off balance. And it's fouled away. He got a mistake right there, but missed it. Can't foul that pitch off in a big spot. 0 2 count. Heater caught too much of the zone. 
Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Ball, and that's he missed high. with it. It's one and two. This is a fun guy to watch when he's up there. Really battles. Doesn't take any pitches off. He's a grinder. No, Always low. seems to make it difficult on the opposing pitcher. Even count. Two balls and two strikes. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. There we got one. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. Two, Sliced two, hard two, on the two. ground. And a base hit into left field. So they've got themselves a one-out base runner. Boy, talking about making a pitcher work, D. Rowe. Eight pitch at bat finally leads off to a base hit. I got to be honest with you. After the seventh the right pitch, field. you start to get an auto oh. swing mode. He could have thrown the what rosin pizza. bag, and he would have took a hack at it. So hats off to him, not only battling for eight pitches, but getting a result. Another one sent foul. And he fouls this one off. Rokio stands at first with one out. Now a throw over, and he's back easily. Ready with another 0 2. No, that's Fastball down. just misses. That's ball one. Well, this is an approach we've seen him use effectively lately. Set up the inside and then get him out with pitches away. Ball, that's out. To two balls and two strikes Sorry, now. now. Hey, started this guy backwards, couple of off-speed pitches early, followed by back-to-back -back heaters. He can go either way he wants to go right now. The 2-2 two -two one more time. Okay, one down now, one down. Donnie finally wears him down here as he strikes him out after a nine pitch at bat. Well, it's been a rough series for him at the plate so far. That's four strikeouts no in bad. the first two games. So this bad. pitching staff clearly has him figured out. Oh, Strike called. Now the throw down. And it skips one. in as he steals the bag easily. That's a great call from the dugout to put the runner in motion that time. With two outs and a good hitter at the plate, it's a pretty low-risk play. If he's out, you still got the same good hitter leading off the next inning. But if he's safe, he's in scoring position One ball, and a lot easier strikes. to drive in. A ball and two strikes now. Line down the left field line. But this is foul near the seats. Now a swing, and he pops him up. This is right out in front of the mound. Number 16 is there, and the side is retired. So here's the cleanup hitter, Nick Prado. Chance to cash in here, and don't be surprised if he does. Certainly known as one of the best clutch hitters in the sport today. First pitch on its way. Strike taken up in the zone. A great job pounding the zone strike one. When you got a great hitter in the box, got to get ahead. Count leverage is a must. I got Behind 0-2 oh, now. Three. And he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. Man, this guy's on his game today, not only when he's throwing strikes, but how about the amount of strikeouts? And what's even more impressive, no walks up to this point. So he's pounding that zone with strikes, and he's making these hitters swing the bat. Catcher. Into the box, Chance Cisco. Oh, and ouch, that one drilled him. Thankfully, oh. he's able to recover, and he gets the second out at first. Striding in once now, again, Tyler Callahan. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Tyler. There's the fastball Callahan. that gets the lower right part here. of the zone called for a strike. One, Grounder one, one. down the line at third. And that's two, a fair two, ball two. as this one gets by him at third. The tag, and they'll Johnny, get him at second. Out. And with that, the side is retired. Ladies Reds are down in order. They trail things here 2 to nothing.
So striding in, number 16. He's been great on the mound, so now we'll see if he can do something with the bat here as well. He's earned the chance to take this at bat. Hey, yeah, Matt, when a guy's go, throwing the it. ball as well as he has, it kind of forces the manager's hand to stay with him. He's been exciting to watch, and he's really had this crowd behind him the entire game. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And this is popped fouled off to the right and back into the seats. Ramos on, has over 40 guys. innings on his line so far. And when you look at his whip over those innings, it's not a particularly Whoa. pretty number, Damn. over 1.5. So he's often dealing with a lot of traffic on the base paths, unfortunately. The 1-1. One, one. Line drive to center field. But sadly for him, this will head straight to the center fielder as he puts it away without much trouble for the second out. Now at the plate, Donovan Casey. He'll start us off in the eighth. Swing and a liner. And that's a fair ball heading out toward the 353 sign on the Ivy. Hey, just a nice piece of hitting right there. He's able to keep his hands inside that ball, stay square as long as possible, and feed it into the opposite field for a base hit. To second for one, on to first, and that's the very last thing they needed at this point in the ball game. As there are quickly two away now. Doesn't come much Your easier than three. that. Taylor made six-four-three double play and an easy one to turn. Seven. Oh hell! Now this is up one and oh. in, and I don't think he likes that location much. It's ball one. Right, He'll enter play with an average of three eleven. Four home runs and 11 RBIs down the third baseline. The 1 1 home. It's taken for strike two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Now here it comes. Grounded yeah, down the third baseline, nope, but foul. a foul ball as it holds it two and two. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Down quietly. So striding forward now, Brian Rocchio. He's working on a one for three thus far. Off we go in the ninth as the first pitch misses for ball one. That misses two and oh. Hey, you want to talk about being in a zone? This guy's been raking lately, and it all starts with his pitch selection. Two great takes, and he's almost daring the pitcher. Just go ahead and challenge him. Popped him up. Mendoza in bench, foul bench, ground makes the play one away. Now in the box, Sean Batista. He looked to bounce back after striking oh. out his last time up. Batista. Here's the first pitch to him. And this one's not one close. It's in the dirt for ball yeah, one. one. Down, one down. Line toward the gap in left center. But this will hang up just enough as he takes it in in stride in left center for the second out. Stepping up now, Steel Walker. He's their last shot here with two away in the ninth as they look to avoid the shutout. Yeah, Matt, they just haven't had any answer for the great pitching so far in this one. Roterer is there to make the catch, and with that, the ball game is over. Wow, not only are complete games rare in this day and age of Major League Baseball, but a complete game shutout. This guy was in total command from the first inning through the ninth. Totally dominant in this one. A 2-0 finish today. Chicago jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Number 16 earns his eighth victory of the season as he racked up 10 strikeouts in the effort. Jose Urquidy pitched well, allowing only two earned, but ends up taking the loss. So that's a wrap for us in this one. Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, Matt Vaskersian, we all thank you for watching Major League Baseball on MLB Network. See you next time. Here now is our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Chicago Cubs.